All right, my name is Jose, and I have passed my CCNA not too long ago. Now, one thing I did while you know preparing for my CCNA was I had to try quite a few study materials until I really found out you know what works best for me. And in this video, I want to share with you what I think are some of the best materials out there. To help you study for and pass your CCNA exam. Now, the first thing I want to mention is uh, books wise, I had to go with the OCG or um, Official um, cert, cert Guide, Official Certification Guide by Cisco Press. I have to say that I have tried other books like the uh, Tom. Todd Lemuel, um, he's also well, well known, he's great, and I think his book is known for not being as dry as the OCG is. I gave him a try, but uh, honestly, I feel like he doesn't go as deep um, in some topics as the OCG does. Also, um, if you are serious about um, getting into networking or I don't know, just mastering any of these crafts. I think going for the official guide is not a bad idea. Um, uh, one, one other thing I want you to know is that the OCG comes packed with some other um, bonuses. Uh, for example, they have an entire website where you can go for flashcards, for some um, um, su supplement vi vi video lessons on some of the to topics they also have a software you can download uh, for um, exam prep and and things like like that so I read the OCG from cover to cover and it helped me tremendously understanding the CCNA topics um, and pass my exam now one other thing you will need is also video lessons uh, now there is, you know, a ton of um, um, solutions out there. You know, you have um, David Bombo is amazing. Uh, if you if you don't follow him on YouTube, please do. He puts out heaps of content, not just on the CCNA, but in networking and and tech as a whole. Follow him; he's amazing. Um, but. I for so for uh, the entire course itself, I had to go for a CBT Nuggets sub, sub subscription. Jeremy does a fantastic job uh, teaching you all the concepts that you need to learn uh, for the CCNA. I got myself a CBTNuggets.com subscription, um, and I still have it until now. I passed my CCNA already. You can see my. Um, my um, certification up there. Uh, sorry, my um, what do you call it? Whatever. Anyway, it's up there. I passed it, uh, but I still have it because I'm still preparing for my CCNP, and I just like to study in general. Um, um, so CBT Nuggets will also offer you um, practice labs. So with every lesson that you're watching, they also have links where you can click. And uh, an, a, a, a Windows will pop up where you can practice what you're seeing. So it's amazing. Um, I, I, I wouldn't say it is very cheap. Um, it's not too bad for me, but people are not the same. Uh, but anyway, it's one th one option that you can consider. I think it's amazing. Um, and yeah. Now, uh, books, videos, now labs man labs for labs i i had to say um boson netsim um labs are amazing um if you haven't haven't heard of boson you're missing out go and google boson like they have these ready made um labs that you don't need to set up anything you click on it the scenario is already uh, set set up. All you have to do is get them to run and lab. You know, you you have all these steps that you you have to follow. 
um, that helps you really solidify um, the CCNA concepts. So I think um, the whole thing is, I think it's a hundred bucks or something for lifetime access. I'm not too sure how much it costs. It, it, it's been a while now, but it's a great, great solution. Now that's um, books, videos, and labs. Now, one last thing I, I want to tell you is, um, please, please, please find yourself a mentor. Um, I really saved a lot on money and time, but by 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 just prevent, uh, being friends with someone who is uh, more advanced than me, um, establish a relationship with with them, um, and just you know ask them things like uh, um, um, people who already made some of the mistakes that you did can save you a lot of time and money sometimes by just sharing with you what they um, were a, a able to learn by the themselves along the way so these are my four tips of things that I think everyone should have if they are serious about their CCNA again um, there are many other solutions out there um, these are my opinion uh, these are things that I think helped me a lot and I think will definitely help a anyone else peace